Hello, my friends, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Nikolai Nenyov. I'm a certified food expert and pharmacist. The topic of today's video is 11 signs of immune system problems and symptoms you should never ignore. Today we are diving into a topic that affects each and every one of us, our immune system. You might not even realize it, but our immune system is constantly hard at work, protecting us from harmful invaders and keeping us healthy. But sometimes, our immune system can encounter problems. And that's what we're going to talk about today. In this video, I'll be sharing with you 11 signs that might indicate you're having immune system problems. Your immune system plays a crucial role in keeping your body healthy and protected from harmful microbes. It can be weak or underactive, leaving you vulnerable to diseases and infections. In contrast, it can be overactive, triggering autoimmune disorders and attacking healthy cells in your body. Autoimmune diseases such as lupus, rheumatoid arthritis, and multiple sclerosis are caused by your immune system mistakenly attacking your own tissues and causing chronic inflammation. Other immune system dysfunctions like allergies and persistent illnesses, such as chronic fatigue syndrome, fibromyalgia, and irritable bowel syndrome, can also seriously affect your quality of life. Therefore, it's essential to maintain a balanced immune system through a healthy lifestyle, proper medical care, and stress management. Number one, if you are experiencing the uncomfortable symptoms of dry or gritty eyes, such as constant redness and the sensation of having grit or sand in your eyes, it may be an indication of an underlying immune system issue, such as Sjogren's syndrome. This autoimmune condition affects the moisture-producing glands in the body, including the tear glands. As a result, the immune system mistakenly attacks the tear-producing glands, leading to insufficient tear production and dry eyes. Without an adequate amount of tears to keep the eyes lubricated, blurry vision may occur and prolonged dryness can potentially cause damage to the cornea. Therefore, it is essential to seek medical advice and proper diagnosis if you are experiencing these symptoms to determine the underlying cause and receive appropriate treatment. Number 2. Depression Believe it or not, depression can be linked to immune system problems. When your immune system is faulty, it can send inflammatory cells called cytokines to your brain which lower your levels of mood-lifting chemicals like serotonin. But here's the good news. Exercise can boost serotonin, lessen inflammation, and help ease your depression. Regular physical activity has been shown to have a positive impact on mental health, specifically depression. Engaging in exercise releases endorphins, which are known as feel-good chemicals that can boost your mood and provide a sense of well-being. Additionally, exercise has been found to reduce inflammation in the body, including the brain, thus combating the detrimental effects of cytokines. By incorporating regular exercise into your routine, you can potentially increase the serotonin levels in your brain and counteract the negative effects of a faulty immune system. So, lace up your sneakers and get moving to improve both your physical and mental well-being. Number 3. Another skin condition that can be attributed to immune system problems is urticaria, commonly known as hives. This condition occurs when the immune system releases histamine, causing small blood vessels to leak and resulting in raised, itchy welts on the skin. Urticaria can be triggered by various factors, such as certain foods, medications, or infections, making it important to identify and address the underlying immune system issue. It is essential to consult a healthcare professional to determine the best course of treatment and manage the symptoms effectively. Additionally, vitiligo is a skin disorder that occurs when immune cells attack and destroy the melanocytes, leading to the loss of pigment in certain areas of the skin. This can result in patches of depigmented skin, which can be distressing for individuals affected by it. Seeking medical advice can help in managing vitiligo and exploring treatments to promote repigmentation. Number four, if you are experiencing stomach or bowel problems, it is important to pay attention to the symptoms you may be having. Diarrhea, belly pain, bloating, and unexplained weight loss are potential signs that should not be ignored. These symptoms could be indicative of immune system problems such as Crohn's disease, ulcerative colitis, or celiac disease. It is important to note that these conditions are driven by the immune system's response to the digestive system. When the immune system overreacts or mistakenly attacks the digestive system, it can lead to inflammation and damage within the gastrointestinal tract. Therefore, it is crucial to seek medical attention and a proper diagnosis if you are experiencing any of these symptoms as early detection and treatment can significantly improve the quality of life for individuals with these conditions. Number five, do you often find yourself with cold hands and feet? 
Well, that could also be a sign of immune system problems. When your immune system is not functioning optimally, it can affect blood circulation and lead to cold extremities. Cold hands and feet are often caused by vasoconstriction, which occurs when the blood vessels narrow due to various factors such as stress, anxiety, or exposure to cold temperatures. However, when it becomes a chronic issue, it could indicate an underlying immune system dysfunction. The immune system plays a crucial role in protecting the body from infections and diseases. But when it becomes compromised, it can lead to a range of symptoms, including cold extremities. In such cases, seeking medical advice and getting a proper evaluation is important to identify the underlying cause and take appropriate measures to support immune system function. Number six, hair loss can be a challenging condition to deal with, especially when it is associated with immune system problems like alopecia areata. This particular autoimmune condition occurs when the immune system mistakenly targets and attacks the hair follicles, resulting in hair falling out in patches. In severe cases, individuals may experience complete hair loss on their scalp and body, leaving them completely bald. Unfortunately, there is currently no known cure for alopecia areata. However, there are treatments available that can help minimize the severity of the condition. Topical corticosteroids are commonly prescribed to reduce inflammation and promote hair regrowth. Another option is immunotherapy, which works by stimulating the immune system to target the underlying cause of the condition. While these treatments may not guarantee a complete regrowth of hair, they offer hope and improvement in managing the symptoms of alopecia areata. Number 7. Sun sensitivity caused by autoimmune diseases can be a significant sign of immune system problems. Other autoimmune conditions such as dermatomyositis and scleroderma can also cause skin sensitivity when exposed to sunlight. It's essential to protect your skin from harmful UV rays by wearing appropriate clothing and sunscreen. Lupus, for instance, is an autoimmune disease that often exhibits rashes and photosensitivity on the skin when exposed to the sun. Some people with lupus may also develop a butterfly-shaped rash on their faces. Seeking medical advice in case of skin sensitivity is crucial since it might be a symptom of an underlying autoimmune disease. Number 8. Joint pain is another common issue related to immune system problems. Certain autoimmune diseases, like rheumatoid arthritis, occur when the immune system mistakenly attacks joint tissues, which can lead to joint pain and inflammation. This chronic inflammatory condition primarily affects the small joints in the hands and feet, causing stiffness, swelling, and discomfort. Lupus, another autoimmune disease, can also cause joint pain as it triggers an abnormal immune response that attacks healthy tissues including the joints. Similarly, psoriatic arthritis, a type of arthritis associated with psoriasis, can result in painful and swollen joints. It is essential to seek medical advice if you are experiencing joint pain, as early diagnosis and treatment can slow the progression of these conditions and improve your overall quality of life. With the help of healthcare professionals, appropriate medications, physical therapy and lifestyle adjustments, managing joint pain caused by immune system problems becomes a possibility. In addition to rheumatoid arthritis, lupus, and psoriatic arthritis, there are other autoimmune diseases that can cause joint pain. For instance, ankylosing spondylitis and inflammatory arthritis primarily affects the spine and can lead to chronic back pain. Sjogren's syndrome, an autoimmune disorder that affects the moisture-producing glands, can also cause joint pain, swelling, and stiffness. Other immune system problems, such as viral and bacterial infections, can also cause inflammation in the joints and lead to pain. However, a proper diagnosis by a healthcare provider is crucial, as the treatment for joint pain caused by infections is different from that of autoimmune diseases. Proper diagnosis and treatment can help manage joint pain, reduce inflammation, and improve mobility, allowing individuals to maintain a better quality of life. Regarding wounds that are slow to heal, immune system problems can indeed contribute to this issue. Conditions such as diabetes, autoimmune diseases, and malnutrition can impair the body's immune response and lead to delayed wound healing. In the case of diabetes, high blood sugar levels can damage blood vessels and nerves, interfering with the delivery of nutrients and oxygen to the wound site. Autoimmune diseases, on the other hand, cause the immune system to attack healthy tissues, including the skin, which can impede the healing process. Malnutrition, especially a deficiency in essential vitamins and minerals, can weaken the immune system and hinder the body's ability to repair wounds effectively. Number 9. 
Do you often feel like you haven't slept well enough, even after getting the recommended amount of shut-eye? If so, it might be a sign that your immune system is struggling. A condition called chronic fatigue syndrome can make even the simplest tasks feel daunting due to its persistent and overwhelming fatigue. Daily tasks like taking a shower or going grocery shopping can be difficult for those with chronic fatigue syndrome. It is important to recognize the signs and seek medical attention if you feel like you may be experiencing this condition. Don't let fatigue rule your life. Take control and seek help. Number 10. When lymph nodes become swollen, it could indicate an immune system response to an infection or injury. The immune system activates white blood cells, leading to inflammation and swelling of the lymph nodes in the affected area. Although swollen lymph nodes are usually signs of natural defense responses, sometimes they can also be an indicator of conditions like cancer. While an overactive immune system can cause lymph nodes to swell, it is not the only cause. Other factors like autoimmune disorders, medication use, and exposure to toxic substances can all lead to lymph node swelling. Swollen lymph nodes may require medical attention, especially if they persist or become painful. Number 11. One of the crucial functions of our immune system is to keep infections at bay. It acts as a defense mechanism, protecting our bodies from harmful pathogens and foreign invaders. However, if you find yourself regularly catching colds, flu, or suffering from frequent ear infections or sinus infections, it might be a sign that there is an issue with your immune system. These recurrent infections could indicate that your immune system is weakened or unable to effectively fight off the pathogens it encounters. It is important to pay attention to these manifestations, as they can impact your overall health and well-being. Seeking medical advice and taking the necessary steps to boost your immune system can help prevent future infections and maintain a strong defense against harmful illnesses. By taking proactive measures, such as adopting a healthy lifestyle, maintaining a balanced diet, getting enough sleep, and managing stress levels, you can enhance the function of your immune system and protect yourself from potential infections. Remember, paying attention to these signs can help you catch potential immune system problems early, giving you a better chance at a healthy recovery. If you're experiencing any of the symptoms discussed, it's important to consult with your health care provider to determine the best course of action for you. By taking care of your immune system, you'll be able to live a happier, healthier life. Stay healthy and be happy. Until next time.